Yeah, thank you. Oh, you're most welcome, dear. <laughs> so we're over here in Busido. This is uh, Pastor Mudibo and his wife Faith, and uh, we're here welcoming. Oh, welcoming uh, our friends from America. This yeah. is Evangelist Chris. Nice to meet you. Chris. <laughs> Thanks for you. And his wife. Okay, well, of course. Yeah. And Pastor Rosuvilo, all the way from Tanzania. Amen. We praise God we come here. Amen. Thank you. Uh -huh. We just came from uh, from another place and they said, oh, This is the son, he's too tall. <laughs> Very tall. We are going to sing three songs. Be blessed as you listen. I just saw so so special. John, I guess it's me. To welcome you, our dear visitors, our dear guests of honor, to all of you. Hello. Yes. I love y'all. What the hell is this? I'm Elwanda. 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 And I just want to bring into remembrance Hebrews 6. And it says that God has not forgotten your labor of love. Your love. Your love for him. And the love you have for his people. You are a very special people. Amen. 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 I weep because I felt that love sitting there. A cry, uh huh? A cry. Abana ndesa muno yura ndeo kulida. Obo. Hey. Hey. Oh, sizira kusiga mbosi ya ya lomo You all have gifts on the inside of you. Mwezi mwe nevi rabu muka timu mwe. That God wants to use. Yasa adau kusisa. Like He did the children. Zephaniah 3 in the Bible. Zephaniah 3. Zephaniah 3. Zephaniah 3. Says the Lord ex exalts over us with singing. But not only that, but he used the kids. They really bless me. He's moving through the kids with the gift that he placed on the inside. And it's not about the visible what we see. Because our God is an invisible God. And he moves through us. Doing mighty things. Amen. God sends people from far, far. They come from over 8,000 miles. That's like, like 9,000 kilometers. Far. And if God allowed them to come to this place for you, listen to what the word of God spoken through these people how it impacts your life this young man said you know he will he call upon the Lord whenever you need him he's there yeah. and she's saying that he in Hebrews where God God has a purpose for your life even through the children each one of you have talents each one of you have something yes. that God has given you only Amen. for the body of Christ Amen. don't sit on your talents yes. don't just sit 
waiting for someone to preach to you, pray for you, talk to you. You go and talk. The Lord has given you life and life more abundant. That's it. So you have the answer to a dying world. Yes, God. Be different. Yes. Dare to be different. Yes. If culture tells you, do this and you know it's against the word of God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. It is an honor to be here with you. My name is Evangelist, Evangelist. Chris Christ Charles Smith. Chris Christ Charles Smith. And I'm from America. Atulaya <laughs> Obama. <laughs> <laughs> My son just told you <laughs> about Jeremiah 33:3. Jeremiah <laughs> To ask God. But I want to also encourage you with Proverbs 3, 5, and it says, Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. God saying he wants us to trust him mm -hmm. no matter the situation mm -hmm. no matter the circumstance mm -hmm. because he's a mighty God mm -hmm. he's an awesome God mm -hmm. he's the source of all things <laughs> he has no rivals mm -hmm. he has no equals mm -hmm. he is mm -hmm. the designer mm -hmm. of the nation amen mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so with Pastor Aurora, Aurora, she just displayed about the fruit. So with that also, when she said your fruit is showing, which means God is allowing you to be that light. Mm -hmm. In the lost world. Matthew 5.14 say we are the light of the world, seated upon a hill that cannot be hidden. So if you are the light of the world, don't hide that light under a basket, but you let your light shine. Why? Because God says in John 3, 16, For he so loved this world that he sent his only begotten son, that every last one of us that believe in him will not, will not perish, but have eternal life. God have eternal life prepared for you and I. He allowed his son yes. to leave eternity to come and enter time to die on a tree for the sins of you and I. Yes. Amen. Amen. First Corinthians 15-52 It says in a moment in a twinkling of an eye at the last trump the dead in Christ will rise and we who are alive and remain should be caught up in the air. In other words, what I'm saying, a time is coming where God is getting ready to come and gather his people, gather his remnant, and take us back to our heavenly home. We are strangers walk in a foreign land so we don't have to worry about sorrow uh, about sickness about pain because all of that have an expiration date Amen. it has to cease one day and one day we're going to dance in the presence of the Lord yes. hallelujah amen, amen. 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 Ganda ga, avansi ze, kompani rirenze, munakuru.